What you're looking at is a little girl who has a cheeky face. Your average blonde hair girl who would grow up to be one of those successful women in the future. However, it was like that for Lucy. She has something brewing inside of her. It was filled with rage, anger and hatred for babies, particularly newborns. This terrifying woman would go on to kill seven newborns, but is suspected of killing more than 13, becoming one of the most prolific child serial killers in modern British history, according to multiple news sources. Despite of the sources close to hospital, also said that they was aware of let be be around babies, but did nothing until it was already too late. Her reign of terror started over a year period during June 2015 and June 2016, believe it or not. This happened a few years ago and she worked as a nurse at the hospital in Manchester, England who is 33 years old as of today, but all of these babies could have been saved if something was said and done. As always, welcome to another episode of Psycho Minds. My name is Cody, and today we will take a deep dive and a closer look at one of the most modern ladies serial killers in recent memory and time. Stick with us as we uncover what exactly happened between January 2012 and August 2023. This case takes place in the city of Manchester, Chester, between the years of 2012 and 2018. Lucy Letby was born on 4th of January 1990 in Hereford, England, and was raised in the same town. She attended at Elstone School and after she left school at Hereford Sixth Form College, Letby began to work as a registered nurse at the Leonatic Unit or Killick of the Countess Hospital in 2012. In a 2013 profile, she said that she was responsible for caring for a wild range of babies requiring various levels of support and that she enjoyed seeing their progress and supporting their families. Lucy also took part in a campaign to raise funds for a new Leo Lato unit at the hospital. She also had two training placements at Liverpool Women's Hospital in late 2012 and early 2015, which came under investigation after her conviction. June 2015, four unexplained collapses at the unit, three of which resulted in deaths in the same month and had noted Let B had been on shift on each occasion when the deaths occurred. The unit consultants also reported their deaths to the Trust Committee for Serious Incidents but they were classified as Natar. An immediate investigation could have been followed in the wake of her killing spree. Lucy was a deranged killer who took the lives of newborn babies because guess what? She wanted to get the attention of a doctor who told her that he wasn't interested in let be. Let's skip forward to a few years after the mystery's deaths that followed in the hospital. In March 2017, the people who worked at a facility in the hospital asked management to involve the police after receiving advice for the religious love letter lead, who suggested further investigation was needed. On 3rd of July 2018, a year later, Let B was arrested by police on suspicion of eight counts of murder and six counts of attempted murder following a year-long investigation into the high infant mortality rates 
at the Countess of Chester Hospital. Let buys home at Chester was seized as subsequent search by police followed her arrest. No evidence that patients at the hospital came to any harm was found due to intentional investigation, though police have begun looking into NetBuy's entire career. On November 11th, 2020, Lucy NetBuy was charged with eight counts of murder and 10 counts of attempted murder. She was denied bail as was remanded in police custody. NetBuy denied all 22 charges against her, blaming the death on hospital hygiene and staffing levels. Her trial began on 10th of October 2022 at Manchester Crown Court and Mr Justice Gross and was due to conclude after six months. She pleaded not guilty to seven counts of murder and 15 counts of attempted murder related to 10 babies. Let by's parents and the families of the victims attended the trial. However, on the fourth day of the trial, the prosecution showed the court a handwritten note from Letby, which said, I am evil, I did this, and that she killed them on purpose because she couldn't take care of them. On 21st of August this year, 2023, she was found guilty and sentenced to at Manchester Crown Court by Goss to life imprisonment with a whole life order, the most severe sentence possible under English law. Let by became only the fourth woman in the UK legal history to receive such a sentence, meaning that she will die behind bars for good. Thank you for watching Psycho Minds. That was the case of Lucy Letby, and why not click one of our videos to see what we post about?